Hey budget fam, I hope that you guys are doing well. It is GB here from Ink and Babes and today is mini Monday. So we have taken out our taupe binder where we are going to be cash stuffing our mini savings challenges. And I do have 20 different savings challenges in this budget binder. This gives me an opportunity to highlight some amazing savings challenges from different YouTubers here in the budget community and also have a little bit of fun. All right, so I'm going to quickly go through all of the saving challenges in this budget binder, and then we're going to go ahead and get started. This is very low income, low budget friendly. All right, so in cash envelope number one, we do have this self-care savings, savings challenge from budget with Mama Bear. It has a B theme to it. In cash envelope number two, we have the rainbow wings. This is a savings challenge from me. This is available on my Etsy store. Rolling with the Peeps, which is very much Easter inspired, is a cash envelope number three. And this is also on my Etsy store. Buzz Off is a bee and honeycomb savings challenge. This is available on my Etsy store as well. Bloom Bloom Wow is a sunflower themed savings challenge. This is available on my Etsy store as well. Peeping It Real, as well as Spring Savings, which is this little bunny with the carrots. These are with the Peeps. And then Picnic Time. This is a collaboration with hot mess budget g and k i have the paper right here g and k designs and budgets and as well as mindy's budgeting so these three are freebies if you're interested in them you can go over and support those ladies i will have everybody listed down in the description box all right um moving on over to cash envelope number nine this is an avocado um saving challenge but i'm using it as a saving challenge even though it's an april no spend and this is from hey k budgets in envelope number 10 this is a farm fun savings challenge from windmill ridge um this actually is a freebie download i just added the um scratch off stickers to it because i thought this would be really fun as a scratch off so that's what i did Moving on over, this is another collaboration savings challenge. And this would be from these ladies here, Jamie RN Budgets, The Blessed Deji Budgets, as well as Sarah on a Budget. Um, I believe this one is from The Blessed Daisy Budget, I believe. But there's actually two more that you can get from the other two ladies as well. Again, they will be linked down in the description. All right, so here is the spin the bottle. This is my savings challenge. This is available on my Etsy store as well. Um, we I ended up replacing, I think there was a wild savings challenge in here from the Almost Organized Owl. Um, I saw this one and I thought this was so pretty. I saw the flowers, the pink, and prayer and self-care. I absolutely love that. This is from Nita. So I put this new one in here as well. Absolutely beautiful savings challenge. You can find this on her Etsy store as well. Then in envelope number 14, this is the teacup challenge. This is from uh, Budgeting with Paula. Smart saving with Paula, but I believe her YouTube channel is Budget with Paula here. Next is Shut the Box, and this is from Savings with uh, Saving with Shalonda. Beautiful pink, bold Shut the Box. I love Shut the Box. Next in envelope number six, this is the Scooby-Doo challenge, and this is from She's Got It, Maria. And it also comes, she sent this as a free you guys, and it also came with a Scooby-Doo dice. Excuse me, how stinking cute is that? Absolutely beautiful. I hope I get to play it. Next up is Spring Into Savings, and this is from Cindy Cat Budgets. She has some of the cutest savings challenges ever. And then in envelope number 18, we replace that with this saving challenge. This is from Cute Budgets. And this is a very, I love this because it has flowers, reminds me of spring. So I ended up, this is a new one. I ended up putting this one inside here and I absolutely love it. There's loads of nominations on here for the flowers as well. And envelope number 19, this is a personalized scratch off GB. This was made by me. This is made for me by Maria over at She Has Got It. And then finally, in cash envelope number 20, this is the Hello Kitty Loves Beautiful Saving Challenge. And this is from the budgeting students. And that's basically it. I do have one bonus saving challenge in here. And this is Save One Pedal at a Time. This is from Jesse's Budget because it has the flowers and also it has really small numbers in there. So I just have this as a bonus cash envelope. All right, so I do have 30 euros here. That, that is all that we're going to be able to put into this saving challenge. I put the real cash, I put it in an envelope to the back here, and I use prop notes, prop US dollars to kind of stuff the cash um, into the cash envelopes. And this should be 30. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 
17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Oh, what did I do? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So that's 10. And then 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Oh, here it is. 11. There we go. All right, so we have all 30 of the ones here, and now it is time for us to get started on our savings challenges. All right, so like I said, I have 20 envelopes here, which means I'm gonna go ahead and get my 20-sided die. Look at this beautiful die that I got from Shein. It's like, it's like part green, part purple. It looks so, so cute and magical. This is 20, right? Nope, it's not. Oh, listen, look at me just getting excited for no reason at all. Um, it's the wrong die I pick up. This is my 12 sided die. This is my 20 sided die here. Okay. All right. We got to put the, we got to put the pretty die back for next time. I don't think I have that color in, um, 20 in a 20 sided die. I think I just have my galaxy die here. The black one It has like little glitters and stuff on there. Anyway. Okay. Let's get started guys. So, our first cash envelope for the night is going to be cash envelope number 11. And that is going to be, oh, yay. So this is the collaboration with um, Daisy Budgets, right? Let me keep this paper out because I keep forgetting. Yeah, so Bless Daisy Budgets, Jamie RN Budgets, and Sarah on a budget. All right, so that's these ladies here. All right, let's see what we're going to do here. I'm actually going to make this low income. So each of these icons are just going to be a dollar for me. So I am going to go ahead and get my marker. And we're just going to take off one soda. One of these cute little sodas. And we're going to add one dollar to that cash envelope. All right, so our first dollar for the night is going in. There we go. All right, moving on. Next cash envelope is going to be cash envelope number 13. Okay, great. So this is the saving challenge by the Almost Organized Owl. And we are keeping this low as well. So we're just going to go ahead and deposit one inside here. I think it's just easier for me to keep them low so that I can do them a little bit quicker, you know? Moving on to the next savings challenge, cash envelope number 10. Yay, we got to do a little scratch off. Now I think I know the highest scratch off, that's the highest number on here if I remember correctly was gonna be five. So, okay. Now what was I using to scratch these off? That's the next question. I think I was just using a, a coin, wasn't I? Okay, one second guys, let me just see if I can find it. Okay, I have my my vacuum here. I should have some coins in my wallet. In the back of my wallet to the back here. So let's take out one of these. Okay, there we go. Close this back up before I forget. I need to I need to stuff this as well before I go to work. Okay, so I have my little coin here. Let's see which one I want to do. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Okay, so we can pull out the twelve-sided die. All right, so I have my twelve-sided die here. I'm going to use the twelve-sided die to tell me which one of these cash envelopes I should go ahead and take off. <laughs> okay, cash. I mean, scratch off number one. This is number one here. All right, first number for this evening is going to be a whopping 
a whopping five. Okay. Oh, the scratch off makes it so much fun. Honestly, so much fun. This was a freebie, guys, from Win Millridge um, Budgets. Please, if you love farm savings challenges, there we go. If you like farm savings challenges, um, this is such a cute one, but she also has an aesthetic one. And she has one for like a one euro, two, not one euro, a dollar, a two dollars, a five, like a ten, straight up to a hundred. And she have a little, a cute aesthetic one. So again, I'm giving you the, I'm giving you the sip sip free savings challenges. Hop on over to her channel, subscribe, and then check her description boxes to get yourself some free saving challenges. So one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three three four five so five dollars is going into this particular savings challenge from windmill susan she has some cute challenges as well she has nasty store as well so feel free to support her as well let's go ahead and get you in there i need to round the edges so that it, they aren't so difficult to get back inside the cash envelope sorry guys struggling just a little bit i should have put the cash in first didn't i all right, so we'll come back to that because I need to round these edges because they they misbehaving themselves. Or maybe because I was trying to do both. Oh, there you go. I was trying to do both at the same time. All right, okay, that was exciting. I love that. Now, where am I? Where What am I doing? Okay, so next savings challenge that we're going to go ahead and cash stuff is going to be number 19. All right, who's number 19? That's 20. Number 19. Okay, oh, this is the night of the scratch-offs. This is the night of the scratch off. So here is our second scratch off of the night. And this is from Maria over at She Has Got It. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So this is a ten sided. This is a ten. So I'm just going to use the 12 sided die again. And then we'll kind of just, we'll just ignore number 11 and 12. Okay, so here we go. All right, number four. So how am I counting this? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Is that how I pointed it? So number four is already done. Okay, let's roll again. Eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay. So let's go ahead and scratch off this number and let's see what we're going to have to save. Yay! I love Maria's scratch off. She's doing me so good always low always within my budget I, i'm gonna soon need another one soon i have a coffee scratch off from her and i also have um another scratch off from her as well so okay let's um all right i love it absolutely love it scratch offs are behaving themselves as they should all right so that is our next saving challenge now completed um if you are new to cash stuffing and you wonder why so many of us are doing mini mondays and tiny tuesdays and coffee wednesdays and build the farms and stuff rather than just putting the money directly into our sinking funds it is because we want to have fun with our money before we put it directly into a sinking fund a bill or an expense this allows us to build a relationship with our money and appreciate all of the hard work that we do right okay you know chit chat let's go ahead and move on over to the next savings challenge saving challenge number one yay so this is the saving challenge, uh, self-care saving challenge. Be kind, guys. And this is from Budget with Mama Bear. We are just going to go ahead and write a one into one of these honeycombs. And we're going to go ahead and deposit a dollar into this saving challenge. That is done. Such a beautiful saving challenge. This was also a freebie as well from Mama Bear. I'm not sure if they're still free to this date at the time of me recording this. But when I got it, it was free. Moving on to the next saving challenge is going to be envelope number four. One, two, three, four. Okay, another honeycomb savings challenge. What do I want to do here? I think for this one, this is Bazaar. This is my saving challenge. 
I'm going to go ahead and roll a die. So you can go, you can choose to put one of the numbers into the honeycomb or you can choose to roll a die and try your luck. So let us see if we can try our luck today. Hopefully the dice gods are going to be kind to us. Rolling the die to see what we have to, ooh, nope, wasn't kind to us. We have a six. So because we have a six, the number that is allocated, the amount that is allocated to a six is going to be five euros. So one, two, three, four, and five. One, two, three, four, five. All right, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna cross this off and this one is now done. So even if I was to roll a six again, I just re-roll because I already did that one. That's gonna keep this low because if you keep rolling and rolling and rolling, you'll, you know, you might never complete it. All right, so one, two, three, four, five. So we've saved five euros, five dollars, five pounds, five Canadian, five Australian. All right, let's move on over to our next savings challenge envelope. Okay, we are going to be going to envelope number 18. Oh, yay, cute budgets. Honestly, my dice really do love cute budgets. Every time I have a challenge in here for cute budgets, I have it. I always end up doing it. So what do we have going on here? So the first one, which is this orange flower, is going to be a one. So we're going to go ahead and say we've completed this one. I'll just write one right there in that little box. All right, so this is now done. Again, I got this off of Cute Budget's Ko-Fi shop or Ko-Fi shop. I don't know how people pronounce it. So definitely check her saving challenges out. All right, so that one is now done. Let's move on over to the next savings challenge. And it is going to be cash envelope number seven, five, six, seven. All right, so this is the spring savings challenge. Again, this is this collaboration from Mindy's Budgets, Mindy's Budgeting, Hot Mess Budgets, G&K Designs, and Budgets. So the first rabbit that we have here is going to be for $3. So that's one, two, three. So we have our $3 here. And we're just going to go ahead and cross this little rabbit out. Cute little bunny. Do you say rabbit or do you say bunny? Or do you say bunny rabbit? Yeah, I don't know. All right, so that's done. We can now go ahead and put the cash away. There we go, all done. Moving on over to the next savings challenge. We are back to number four. Is this cute budget again? No, it's not, okay. <laughs> it's me. Okay, let's see. Let us see what is going on tonight. Buzz off, what do I wanna do? I'm gonna go ahead and go for a low one today. And we're just gonna go ahead and take off that dollar honeycomb there. Here's the dollar, so that is now done. And we can tuck this back into our savings challenge. Moving on to, okay, we think we're down to our last 10. One, two, three, four, five. And one, two, three, four, five. Honestly, so much fun. Moving on to the next saving challenge, guys. Envelope number 20. What is envelope number 20? Okay, great. So this is the um, same challenge from the budgeting student. So each set of these um, three there's like a group of hearts. Each one of them I've allocated $1 for. So let's go ahead and corner that in. I just, needed, I just needed to grab my marker here. So I'm just gonna go ahead and color in my heart. One, two, three. All right, that is done. So now I'm gonna go ahead and these are the ones from last month that I already did. So you know what, let me just make sure that I put on here that this is what I'm doing this month. So I know what I, I'm doing this month. So I'm just gonna cross it out. Okay, so that's $1 going into there. All right, moving on over to our next cash envelope, number 17. Yay! This is the Spring Into Savings Challenge uh, from Cindy Cat Budgets. I'm gonna go ahead and color in, let's do two. So we color in a little ladybug and we've colored in a cute little flower. So we're adding our $2 into there. Um, let me just write that this was February just so that I don't get confused when I check this and be like, I have these colored in, why is that only $2 in there? Yeah. 
I probably should have done that for the syndicate one as well. Not the syndicate one, um, budgeting student. I should have write that those were, yeah, let's do that before I get confused. Those were part of February. Okay, that's now done. Okay, so our next saving challenge, let's go ahead and roll our die. All right, envelope number seven. Okay, so we're back to the spring savings with the little bunnies. And I do not think I have the five, so I'm gonna go for the next one, which is going to be a two. Because I would like to get to another savings challenge. So let's go ahead and cross that one off. Such a cute challenge. I just love seeing these little cute bunnies. Okay, that one's now done. Let's roll our die and see the next cash envelope. Okay, cash envelope number two. This is our rainbow wings savings challenge. This is the one that I created. Each of these rainbows, I allocate $1 to one euro. They are, this is such a pretty challenge. I hate taking it off. I'm just gonna go ahead and do two butterflies off of this one. They are so cute, so pretty. All right, there it goes. Go in there. That's now done. So we do have $2 left. And that's going to be, this is going to go to, oh, three. One, two, three. Oh, my bad. Excuse me. All right, so we have three left. Let's see what's the last cash envelope. I might just do all of the, the last one to have all of the, um, the final three. All right, who's going to be the lucky cash envelope? All right, cash envelope number 15. It is going to be you today. Oh, my goodness. It is shut the box. We finally get to play shut the box but the problem is we only have three so what does that mean am i going to have an iou today i guess we will have to find out in order to play shut the box you are going to need two die and you roll the die and whatever the sum of the amount is that's the numbers that you take off so let's see how far we get on shut the box this is a saving challenge by saving with shalonda all right first up let's go all right, we have four. All right, let's color in four on here. That's done. Let's roll our die again. Four again. If I get another four, it's gonna be a problem. I am doing this the low income way, guys. I will not be saving a bunch of cash on this and I'll show you what I mean. Let's roll our die again. Five. All right, so we can only take off this five here. So that's good. Let's roll that die again. Four and four is eight. Okay. So we can take off the eight here. And now let's roll that die again. Five. Right. So we can't shut. <laughs> we can't shut the box. So technically speaking, I owe this $1. What I'm doing now is like the traditional way is to add the nine, the seven, the six, and the two all together. But I'm doing shut the box the low income way, which means I will save a dollar for any numbers that I have left over. Now, since I do have three here, it technically means that I need to put in, what is this? Oh, this one euro here. Oh, I'm gonna use my coin then. And then the next time I play this, I will just, um, you know, one, two, three, 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 and four. So I'm just gonna write over here four euros that we saved for this round of shut the box. Okay, wasn't successful with shutting the box, that's okay, but we were able to save some cash for it. So we've completed and ended off our mini Mondays with our shut the box savings challenge. All right, that is it for me today, guys. Thank you so much for spending time with me. Um, I really had a really fun, and I got to play so many different saving challenges. I absolutely love that. We got through a lot of the saving challenges tonight. Um, and, and you know what? We were able to, the two collaborations, we were able to get to those as well. The new saving challenges we were able to get to from Nita and Cute Budgets. And we got to do two scratch-offs. So great. This was a really great night. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you in the next video. Bye, guys.